Oh hi, I didn't see you there. Today I have with me Spencer and Jennifer, and we're also accompanied by Fago, the drink of the juggalo, <coughs> and Caramel Schmirnoff, or for the gays it's Queernoff. And what we're going to do is play a couple little drinking games. Okay. So the first thing we're going to be doing is playing a sex trivia. I'm asking you true or false questions about sexual things. If you get it wrong, you take a shot. Okay. Gotcha. Are you ready? Yeah. yeah. Let's do it! Who are you? So the first question is for Spencer. It's possible for a guy to have multiple orgasms. True. That is correct. You do not have to take a shot. Jennifer, what percentage of men in relationships always have an orgasm during sex? 55%? 75% or 95%? I'll stick with 75 because there's some guys that probably can't get off. That's true, girl. <laughs> <laughs> That's the right answer. What? This quiz is boring. What is the average length of a hard penis? 3 to 4 inches, 6 inches, or 5 to 6 inches? 5 to 6. I don't know. I'm going to say 3 to 4. <laughs> wrong? Oh, really? Said, really? You said wrong. Uh, you already knew that was wrong. No, because most most people have small dicks. Bottoms all. Spencer, if a guy thrusts too hard, could he break his penis? True or false? True. That is false. <laughs> what? Let me see. Jennifer, who daydreams more during sex? Men or women? I feel like that's a woman thing. That's correct. Right. <laughs> Dominic. Yes. In the U.S., most people's number of sexual partners are in the single digits. True or false? I'm gonna say that's true. Most people. Really? Most people's sexual encounters are in the double digits. His that's or her lifetime. People are gross. Oh, in his or her lifetime? Hell yeah, that was way more. People are slutty. Ha. Spencer, in some parts of the country, girls have to get approved from their parents before waxing down there. True or false? In some parts of the country? Of the country. False. That I is true. That is true. Think about gypsies and shit. Yeah. Some parts of the country, you have to get approved from your parents before getting a Brazilian. What are you talking about? Waxing your vagina! <laughs> Why would a woman have to have permission? I don't fucking <laughs> know! <laughs> There are some religions and shit, like gypsies, that have certain traditions yeah. and ways. What do you think Amish? Well, Amish and don't shave. All types of evil shit, if you don't listen. If you wax, the devil's gonna come for you, Barbara. They're coming for you, Barbara. Take a shot. What fucking world do we live in? This is <laughs> Trump's America. <laughs> he always liked the bush. <laughs> The clitoris has twice as many nerve endings as the penis. I say that's probably true. That's true. All right, I'm good at this. The bigger a guy's feet are, the bigger his penis is. I'm gonna say that's false. I'm correct. It's false. Spencer, do you guys have a G spot? The G spot. I haven't heard that name in years. Just hearing it makes my legs want to touch the ceiling. I am a bottom. I am. A bottom. Yeah. <laughs> and then God said unto thee, No homo. As he put the G spot in the ass. <laughs> Jennifer, <laughs> sex burns as many calories as running a mile. False. It's true. What? Yeah, it's true. You're getting down and wow, dirty. Man. You must be lazy as fuck. <laughs> All right. If a guy has a small flaccid penis. What's a flaccid penis? <laughs> <laughs> a flaccid Do, means you know, limp. Oh, sorry. Thank you. Keep Not going. erect. <laughs> <laughs> What's a flaccid? <laughs> if a guy has a small flaccid penis, it won't be much larger when erect. I'm gonna say that's false. Yeah. Gotcha. Mm. <laughs> After the bedroom, what's the second most popular place people have sex? 
The kitchen, the car, or a public restroom? The car. That is true. That's, that would have been my guess, too. Guys can fake orgasms, too. I think that's true, but they don't do it as much. That's correct. <laughs> I should know. Bitch. <laughs> Why you gotta be so rude? Don't you know I'm human, too? <laughs> Oh yeah, my fucking friend Desiree. Oh man, I shouldn't say this on camera. Oh, <laughs> Dom, you need to edit that in. Spencer, how many times a year does the average American couple have sex? 32, 66, 89, or 100, 126? I would say 126. In Incorrect, the, the number is 66. I get it more than you. Well, that's kind of sad. <laughs> that is a little sad. Which gender has a higher preference for reaching orgasm through oral sex? I'm gonna say men. Females. What? Really? Dude, Dude Was it's the right? bomb. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, know, I would man. not know. Well, you just learned about 10 minutes ago that the clipped chorus <laughs> has higher sensitivity rating. I guess so. <laughs> I was going to say, right before he said that, that there's this little thing called the clitoris, and he just nailed that. I don't know. <laughs> he nailed it. Listen to the words ew. you're saying. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Leave it to the gay man to go, ew. <laughs> ow! <laughs> ow! Clitoris! Ow! <laughs> Vagina. Ew. <laughs> How long is it before the average man ejaculates during sexual intercourse? 5.4 minutes, 9.1, 18.7, or 32.6? minutes. That sounds right. Correct! Really? Men don't last long. Jenna, stress can make a man's penis shrink. True or false? I bet it's true. That is correct. All right. <laughs> Older women are more likely to experience orgasm when sex is within the context of a relationship. I'm gonna say that's true, because people are old-fashioned. What?! <laughs> no. <laughs> women over age of 50 are more likely to report at orgasm when the sexual event with someone not, not in a relationship. Yes. That is stupid! Y'all some fucking hoes. Take it all back. Swallow. <laughs> Spencer, masturbation can improve sexual function, be a sign of sexual dysfunction, cause genital inner injury, <laughs> or all of the above. I think it could be all of the above. Correct! <laughs> <laughs> Jennifer, most, most women under the age of 60 think about sex less than once a day. True. Right. What percentage of women say they always have an orgasm during sex with their partner? 14, 29, 48, or 74? 29? What? That was correct? Wait, it was? Wow. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> so since Jennifer seems to know the most about sex, we are going to take her and make her watch a video that she's never seen before that has to do with sexual things. And that is, Gilbert Godfrey reads Fifty Shades of Grey. And every time she laughs, she has to take a shot. So let's see if we can get her to giggle. <laughs> Audible.com presents Fifty Shades of Grey, the erotic best-selling novel read by Gilbert Gottfried. My inner goddess has stopped dancing and is staring too, open mouth and drooling slightly. Hear it the way it was meant to be heard. Keep still, he orders, and slowly he inserts his thumb inside me, rotating it around and around, stroking the front wall of my vagina! No fisting, you say. <laughs> Anything else you object to? I agree to the fisting, but I'd really like to claim your ass! Famed voice actor Gilbert Gottfried gives a reading that can only be described as sensual. Holy fuck is this wrong! But holy hell is it erotic! 
Let Christian Grey seduce you over and over again through the voice of Gilbert Gottfried. But when he hits my clitoris! <laughs> My friend Gilbert Gottfried recorded a promotion for Fifty Shades of Grey, the best-selling erotic novel. Many fans insisted I'd enjoy a special connection to the book and that I ought to do an audio narration for it. I was intrigued, so I grabbed a copy to see what all the fuss was about. Over my stomach, between my thighs, with his long-fingered hands, Oh my. <laughs> oh, oh three of us. <laughs> Just in case. Ah. My mouth slack and I groan. The pressure is building slowly, inexorably inside me. Oh my. He thrusts his hips again. His eyes are wide, wary, and filled with salacious need. Need for me. Need for my mouth. Oh, my. <laughs> <laughs> no. No. I saw it coming when I read, oh, my. I'm feeling, I'm feeling inebriated. Okay. Skin against skin. Moving slowly at first, easily, testing me, pushing me. Oh my. Grabbing my upper thighs, he forces my legs apart. I groan loudly, feeling his tongue circling my clitoris. Oh my. Oh my, my, my. Crumb fries. Drink it like it's hot cocoa. Right? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, what a delightful arm cabin drink. With a caramel smear off. <laughs> In a cup. <laughs> what the fuck? Alright guys, well I hope you enjoyed that very sexy, very drinky video. And if you did, make sure you give this video a nice, juicy, sexy thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell because I make new videos every single Friday and Sunday unless I'm drunk. Do you want to do more shots? No. Now go in.